And now, Phillipsburg Broadcasting proudly presents Good Morning, Mr. Governor, with Francis Cardi. Good morning, Mr. Governor. Respect our autonomy. As a country within the Kingdom of the Netherlands, we were told that we have certain inalienable rights as a country and that no changes to these inalienable rights can be tampered with without the consent of the other members of the Dutch Caribbean. As a matter of fact, this proviso was carefully articulated as the purpose for the recently proposed consensus law to establish the Caribbean reform entity. The Dutch government took it upon itself to unilaterally conceive and develop the framework for the CRE and provided a short period of time for the Dutch Caribbean islands to make a decision. Obviously, this method of pushing the envelope on these islands did not work. So the question is, why didn't it work? It didn't work because the State Secretary of Home Affairs and Kingdom Relations, Raymond Knops, felt that his heavy-handed approach to these islands' future development should work as he wants them to work, rather than to entertain cordial negotiations and investigations between and among these islands to ensure a smooth and thoughtful path towards the eventual resolution of issues such as a more effective public financial system, greater economic sustainability, better health care services, and a strengthened justice system. Every one of these issues will take more than one sit-down session, and they will not be realized with a take-it-or-leave-it negotiation approach. Therefore, it is within everyone's best interest to live up to our kingdom-advertised philosophy of many destinations in one kingdom. This is the philosophy that has glued this kingdom together, And it is the philosophy by which we should take our time to respectfully negotiate whatever issues that we wish to resolve. Good morning, Mr. Governor. That was Good Morning, Mr. Governor by Francis Cardi.